Oh, hey, stranger. Where have you been? I've been sort of busy lately. I saw your car outside. How come you're home? I just felt like taking the day off. That's not like you. <laughs> I know, but since Peter's been on board, I've been able to catch up with virtually everything. I mean, look around. I'll bet you barely recognize the place. Everything is in order. Everything works. That's nice. Oh, God, he really is such a godsend. There's nothing the man can't do. You're happy with him, I take it? Oh, yes. In every way, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Though he is a bit quiet. Today is his six-month review, and I've decided that I'm going to allow him to open up more. I thought that's what you did not want to happen. No relationships, remember? Yeah, well, I know, but I've been thinking lately I can relax that condition a little bit. I think I know him well, but I kind of want to get to know him more. I want to be able to tell him more about me, and he just seems so caring and intelligent. He really is a lovely man. I hate to admit it, but I think you were right some months ago when you said that sex and relationships do go hand in hand. I see. Yeah. How do you think he's going to feel about that? Well, I'm sure he'll be fine with it. I. I can tell that he's been wanting to open up to someone, and who else but me? I really don't think that he has anyone else that he's close with. Poor man. How would you know that? Yeah, it's just my feminine instinct. Ooh, that must be him. So if you don't mind, we have to do the review in private, so just say, hey, how are you? Have a nice day, and then scratch. Of course. Right. Morning, Miss Vickers. It's Linda. Uh, you remember Julie? Uh, yes, of course. Good morning, Julie. Good morning. Julie was just about to leave so that we could start your review. Okay, take care. No, wait. Stay. Uh, but Peter, this is a private matter. No, it's not. Not anymore. This entire charade has got to end. That is exactly what I wanted to talk to you about. I think that we should open up more. I can tell that it's been on your mind, and I'm willing to work with you on it. Miss Vickers, you're blind. What? Miss Vickers, for the past six months I've come here practically every day, doing everything your little heart desired. We never talked about anything meaningful. Most of the time I was just here by myself. Oh, but I can fix that. All by myself. Except for Julie. Without her, Miss Vickers, I don't think I could have lasted this long. Julie would come over and we'd have coffee and talk about anything. anything. <laughs> I need that, Miss Vickers. I'm so terribly alone here every day. She really is a wonderful woman. I wanted to tell you Skip that. Skip it. Which is why this job has to end now. I'm gonna play husband. I might as well do it for real. Julie and I were married yesterday. Julie, how could you do this to me? I'm sorry, Linda. It just sort of happened. I didn't think he meant anything to you. Well, you, you should have asked. You never would have admitted it, now would you? Wish me luck, Linda. Go! Wanted one male, 30 to 40, must be personable, reliable, and open to a long-term relationship. 